In 2018, we held a competition to find the best rapper to join our team. We picked 50 out of the hundreds that applied and put them head to head through several rounds to test their skills. We eventually picked the one and hired her. We also ended up hiring three more from the competition. It's now 2022 and we're doing it all over again. You're watching The Rap Job Season 2, sponsored by Avery Dennison and DeWalt. Hi everyone, welcome to Rap Job Season 2. Let's meet the contestants. All right, guys, welcome. How are you all feeling then? Ready? Yes. Let's meet the judges. Hi, how are we all? Nervous? Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> so of course we've got Simon from Urban Automotive. What are you expecting to see today then, Simon? Well, I'm just, I'm, I'm grateful that where these guys have traveled from, we've, we've got people from far and wide here. I'm mm. gonna wish you good luck. Um, I know you're obviously pr pretty nervous, but you'll smash it, you'll do good. So, Yanni from Yanomise, what are we saying? Series two, I recognize a couple of people here um, and obviously some new faces. I'm sure you've watched the rap job before. I'm sure you've seen what we expect, the levels we work to. Someone today will leave with a job and they'll be working right here. So the pressure's on, but enjoy it and good luck. And Chris, Operations Director at Urban. So you're gonna be like the controller, you're gonna- Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm looking for personalities as well and what people are gonna be like working with each other as part of a team, mm -hmm. um, as well as obviously hopefully being a good rapper, but we can grow on that as well. So yeah, good luck guys. Perfect. And Mark from Avery, what are you expecting to see? Uh, just looking at different application techniques, how they handle the vinyl, and um, yeah, and have a bit of fun. Africa. This man flew from South Africa. So I'm Liam Reed. I'm 22 years old, from South Africa. Still live there. I travelled just for this year. It's a big, big move, but for an experience like this, I would say it's worth it. I've only wrapped one car fully, and then I've done like the roof of a, another small car. But other than that, nothing. A lot of the other guys, they their full-time job so that the pressure's on for sure. No, I'd say good luck to everyone. It's a small crowd this time so it's going to be quite intense but yeah good luck to everyone. Hope it goes well. Should be fun. So you're serious about it? Definitely. Okay you're definitely serious flying from South Africa. Yeah. Who flew from Portugal? Another serious man. Yeah. Are you prepared to move? Yeah absolutely. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, and someone, someone drove him from Wales? Are you prepared to relocate? Because obviously we had Kian. Yeah, uh, my girlfriend's actually from England, so we will be moving back to England. <laughs> okay, so listen, they've travelled in from far and beyond. Um, but it can only be one winner. Mark's obviously a trainer with Avery, and he does a little thing with a balloon. Now, I don't know if you've seen this before, so we're going to give each of you a balloon and you guys are going to put a vinyl strip and you're going to use your knife to cut the vinyl strip. The job is don't pop the balloon. This is just for fun. So enjoy it. And if we hear a few pops, good luck. So it'd be rude for obviously Mark being the Avery trainer, not to do it himself first and show you how to do it without popping the balloon. We're going to, we're going to step back. No pressure. So this is what you need to do, guys. Right, you need to take your strip of vinyl. Okay, apply it to the balloon. 
So the idea is that we're going to score the vinyl, not pop the balloon, but then you need to be able to open the vinyl up. So you do need to cut it, okay? Uh, nice fresh blade, okay? And just try and let yourself use the weight of the knife. Okay, so now hopefully, with a bit of luck, you open the vinyl up. Okay? So, he made it look very easy, even though you can see his hand shaking. <laughs> but guys, it is your turn. You've got about 20 or 30 seconds. It took him probably 10 seconds. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. sweaty hands watching. Uh, we're going to try this, we're going to do this as well. You've had 20 seconds. And that's your time. Right, one second guys. Oh! So Liam's popped it, Jarvis had a heart attack. Oh! Okay, hold on one second. One second, right Jarvis, let's see. First of all, let's go to Jarvis. Okay, Yay! well done, well done, well done. Liam's popped it, Artur's popped it. Matthew? Not enough pressure. Okay, but you didn't pop the balloon. You didn't do it, but you didn't pop the balloon. Okay, well listen, that was just for fun, guys. Now, it's the real test. Get rid of the balloons, let's wrap the Wigner up. Round one is wrapping a Defender mirror cap. We'll be using an Avery Supreme wrap film. The advantages of using Supreme wrap film is the slideability, the ease of use, it's very flexible. The things we'll be looking out for is not too much overstretching, how you handle the material, how much heat you put into the material. We'll be looking for glue lines to so try and minimise the glue lines you get. You'll get five minutes to complete the task, so good luck. Right guys, you've got five minutes and the time starts now. Yeah, I've only got five minutes. It's very difficult to wrap a wimmer cap. When it's on a desk and you're holding it, usually you yeah. can have it it's secure. So we try to make it as hard as possible for these guys. There's going to be different techniques for different people. It's quite interesting to see it unfold. Okay, but if you look, 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 look at the difference in thing. Look what Jarvis has done. Right. Jarvis has taken the vinyl on the desk, pulled it away, eating the vinyl. The rest of them will put the vinyl down on the Wimmerick app. So is there any standouts already that you can see that like, the right technique, if anyone's doing it wrong? I wouldn't say wrong, there's no right or wrong, but this guy, what's his name? Jarvis. Jarvis has got a good technique. My name's Jarvis, I'm 26, I'm from Essex. I first wrap that was stressful, my experience wasn't as much. So I've been wrapping full time for various companies and myself, yeah, about four or four plus years now. I feel like I'm ready, so I've got to put out my top tier best wrapping this year, I suppose. This is the, this is the test, isn't it? So I've done this before, so I've already got the, the top advantage of you guys. Right guys, that's halfway, halfway. It's not an easy thing to do. Um, Jarvis's technique is obviously the better one. Is that the one you would have used? Uh, if I'm on my own, yes. The reason being the other guys have taken the backing paper off, put the vinyl on the table, contamination. Liam's struggling. He's definitely, definitely struggling. We're going to say that artist is good anyway, because he's massive and he'll eat us both. Yeah, I, I, that's the last person I want to annoy. Him. My name is Arthur, I'm 33 years old and I'm from Peterborough. So I've done only wrapping first car bonnet, the second car uh, interior flaps and uh, where's the head unit and some bits in the home, like speakers and subs, and that's it. Only what I've done is I've done course on uh, training, three days, so, but it's basically nothing as well. No problem at all, only about when I take a knife, there can be trouble. <laughs> one minute left, people, one minute left. Feeling the pressure? No pressure? No pressure. Okay. Jarvis, feeling the pressure? Definitely. 
Definitely. Liam, feeling the pressure? Yeah, it's very hard to do a mirror off the car. So he said it's very difficult to do a mirror off the car, which is why we've done it. 30 seconds, guys, 30 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Right, mirrors down, heat guns off, please. So guys, well done. Five minutes goes very, very quickly. Now, we know it was fast. We know it's not easy to wrap a wing mirror just on the table on your own, but it's not about who finishes it. It's about how you handled it and how you've managed to get to a certain level. But guys, well done. Thank you very much. And we'll see you a bit later on. Well done. Did anyone stand out? Was you disappointed? Was you like, okay. Yeah, I think Jarvis, is it here? Yep. Had the best technique. Pinned it on the table. Uh, yeah, same probably. Uh, Jarvis, best technique, art as, as well. Pretty, it looks from here anyway. It looks good for it you, doesn't it? Yeah. It's got a bit laid, at least. It's and nice from it. far, but far from nice. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I think Jarvis just made recovery. Last 45 yeah. seconds, yeah. me and Mark sort of spotted it just go into place. Yeah, yeah. good. Lenny, send Liam in, please. Got Liam. Let's um, go see the judges, see how you got on, mate. So, Liam, how did you find it? Very difficult. It was very tricky. Uh, didn't know how to approach it at first. All of us were in here earlier, looking at the mirrors, scratching our heads a bit, but, yeah, it was fun. Your technique that you used for the mirror, are you happy the way you went with it, or would you have done something different now? Yeah, probably, definitely the heat gun. I didn't realize you could crank the heat up on the little screen at the back. So I was battling with quite low heat, didn't get enough uh, heat into the material, I was battling to stretch it. So that's definitely one thing I would change for sure. How did you find the material? Yeah, it's good. It's, it's easier to work with than a lot of other films. How happy are you with what you've done today so far? Not happy. Uh, I did lift it up about halfway and start over like the, the same piece of material. But um, yeah, I'm not, not exactly happy with this. What was the reason for you relifting it? Um, I started on the harder side, trying to stretch it down there. Okay. And yeah, I just realized at least try to get a little bit more done and go on the flatter side. Okay. You didn't put your glove on? No, I didn't. I, I did use it uh, like free, well, putting your glove on, handling the material gets, it gets stuck quite easily. Um, but yeah, I find it easier just to pick the glove up and put it around your finger to push and knock grooves and stuff like that. Okay. Well, listen, Liam, well done. Thank you very Thank much. You. And we'll see you later. Lenny, send Jarvis in, please. You should be used to this. Still stressful, <laughs> even after all this time. I see the Jarvis here, you got on, mate. Jarvis, how did you find that? That was all right, it was good. I think I could have done better, but obviously given the time and pressure, obviously everything you know just goes out the window. So I think considering the circumstances, I'm reasonably happy. I think your technique was probably the better. Yeah. Yeah, we noticed, didn't we, early on, so stretching it and heating mm -hmm. it off the, off the bench, you was the only one out of the four that did that. I think um, normally I wouldn't wrap off the vehicle and if I was going to finish it all in under I'd wrap on the vehicle, pop it off, then do the finishing. Yeah. Just you've got, you've got that leverage for the like, proper stretch and stuff like that. It wouldn't be as much fun though would it? No exactly, that's what, that's what it's all about isn't it, 50% fun. <laughs> was the pressure as much as the first series? Because you've been here, you've done this before, so you've got an advantage over everyone else here today. Um, I mean, getting up this morning and driving here, I was like, oh, it's fine, it's fine. But obviously, as soon as I turn up here and I see you all standing up at the window, I was like, oh, God. Yeah, it's just as bad, to be honest, the pressure. Everyone watching all the cameras. It looked like it was going really, really well early on, and then halfway through it, it all... Because I'm even though I've wrapped this mirror before, I'm used to doing it in a different way, and then changing the whole dynamic is like, actually proper throws you off. And then, you, especially when you know you've got five minutes, you've got to think about it, and then you've got to practice the technique, and you've also got to do it in that time as well. And I was like, oh, my God. Probably spent the first 30 seconds just like panicking. <laughs> Are you happy with what you've done today? Yes. Okay, listen Jarvis, thank you very much. We'll speak no to you later. Thank you. Lenny, send Matthew in please. My name's Matt, 30 years of age and I'm from Derby. I've got quite a decent amount of experience. I've been rapping for like two and a half years, running my own small business with my other partner for like two years. Don't want to be too cocky, but I reckon I've got a good chance today. I don't know, Alex, um, the Portuguese guy who's from Brazil, 
Um, he seems pretty like quiet and like quite confident. He seems pretty calm. I probably think Alex to be fair, but we'll, we'll see. Watch out, guys. Bring your A game because if you don't, I'm gonna get you. How you feeling, mate? All good. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Right, can I can't see the judges, mate. It's like one of your brothers. Corporate head. <laughs> <laughs> He's hired. <laughs> I didn't think that. <laughs> Matthew, how did you find it? Good, uh, challenging obviously off the car. Um, yeah, but no, found it okay. How did you find working with the vinyl? The vinyl's fine, I've used it before. Um, yeah, I was happy with using the vinyl. Um, but like you say, it does create glue lines easily. So is there, is there anything you would do different if you could do it again? Uh, I might cut the size down a little bit. Um, I knew what I wanted to do. I wanted to hook it on the edge, heat it and stretch it right across, but it's difficult when that happens because uh, there's so much curve to it. Um, that was my strategy. And then doing that obviously is a lot harder because um, it's quite a big piece. I think I would have cut it down a little bit more, to be honest. Are you happy with what you've done today? No, because I would have liked it to be finished, but um, I, yeah, it can always be better. It can always be better, but no, I'm not, I'm not happy with what I've done here. It can be better. Okay, Matthew, well done. Thank you very much. We'll thank see you later. Cheers. Cheers, thank you. Lenny, send in our tools, please. Oh, just, let's go. Now, you don't look like you can be intimidated by anyone, so yeah. don't be intimidated by the judges. <laughs> go to your table, mate. <laughs> Artis, welcome. Thank you. How did you find it? It can be better because I've done a mistake. I straight away take a glass, which I shouldn't do that because it's sticky and didn't give me proper to keeping the vinyl to stretching properly how it should be. But unfortunately, it is like it is. We did think, though, that the face of yours was actually really, really good. You know, the, the, the yeah. cleanness of your, your, your main face on the wing mirror is really, really good. So although someone else had a better technique to start off with. Yeah, that's what I said. Your if, finished If I probably then. do that without glasses, maybe I finish more than it is right now. But unfortunately, mistake is mistake. What would you have done different? Uh, firstly, because without gloves, you can't stretch it properly. The gloves are always sticky and then when you take it there, it's sticking with this piece. So basically you're pulling both sides. So without gloves, it'd be more easier. Plus, I don't know how, how much do I need the heating or not because I've never done with this vinyl. You've never worked with Avery before? Wow. Just once. Okay. And it was uh, gold. So only once I done and that's it. Okay. So it's basically the first time for me. So first time, not bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 First time, good. Not bad. The only thing I would say is wearing a watch when you're working with vinyl material. Yeah, you, I need to take off ring, watch as well, yeah. So you can damage the vinyl. Yeah. Um, are you happy with what you've done today? So far, yes. It's, of course, it can be better. Okay. Every time it can be better. Well done. Thank you so much. Yeah. So we've seen the first four. It was real, real cool. You could see the pressure was on. Nerves, nerves. Next episode, we are going from nine people down to six, and you do not want to miss it. Series two, I recognize a couple of people here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. Hi. Hi, my name is Enrique. Is Enrique. Enrique. Is Enrique. I come here to take back what's mine.